Good morning, boys and girls. It is Monday, March 23rd, 2020, and I miss you all. OMG. Can't believe it's been so long since I've seen you. Hopefully, we will get to see each other sooner than later. Um, so this is my morning message to you, and it's coming to you live. Well, not really live. I recorded it a few minutes ago from my kitchen. Um, right now, Molly is eating breakfast, right? Yeah. You want to say hi? Look. Hi. Say hi. Molly's eating breakfast. Regan is still sleeping, and she needs to know that school starts shortly. So, anyway, Mom. just a quick time for me to hop on. Mom. Yeah? Is she not sleeping? She just, she heard me say she was sleeping, and she told me she wasn't sleeping. Right? Okay. I'm almost done. So I just want to hop on and for tell you guys a couple things. Number one, we got this. It's new to lots of us. You guys are like pros at Google Classroom, so I'm not entirely worried that you can't handle this, but we're just going to be doing a lot more like independent stuff. Like I'm not going to be there to remind you to do your best work all the time, that kind of thing. So you know what's expected in fourth grade. So I'm expecting you to do your absolute best, try your best, keep yourself engaged in what we've been learning and some new stuff. That's all I'm asking you to do. Connect with me, email, message, send things, um, question. That's what I'm here for. Um, so you'll see assignments posted um, in the classroom every day. For example, today is Monday. So we have um, math, we have word study, we have um, reading and writing and science. Um, you do not have to sit there and do everything like in the normal order that we do it in. It's available to you all day long. You could do work for an hour, take a break. It's kind of like design your own school day. So you guys can do that. Um, my kids have a schedule that we're going by, but I've built in like nice breaks for them. Um, so this is not meant to feel like a real full school day, but it is meant for you to do some work and engage your brain. So please do that. Um, I'm not expecting perfection. I just want to keep in touch with you and still continue to teach you. Um, another fun fact about today, it's National Dog Day. So I don't have a dog. Someday we hope to have a dog. I have a dog on my shirt. I'm wearing my Broad Street Bulldog shirt today because it's Spirit Day too. So it's National Dog Day, so I thought something fun would be is if you have a dog in your life, it could be a dog that you live with, it could be a grandparent's dog or an aunt's dog or a neighbor's dog, and you happen to have a picture of that or take a picture today, send it to me in an email and I will upload it right under the morning messages so we can see everyone's dog for National Dog Day. You just can't use the excuse that your dog ate your homework because actually you kind of have a lot of homework or maybe you could look at it as I have no homework. I don't know. So I hope to see some of those fun pictures. Email them to me. I will put them up in the classroom. Have a wonderful day and please, please, please reach out with any questions and I will hopefully talk with you guys a little later. Have a great Monday. Bye.